Hello, this is Dr. Victoria Scribo, and this is your astrological weather for Thursday, January 30th. Well, Happy New Year, everybody. Today is the Chinese New Year, the year of the wood horse. In Chinese astrology, the element of wood is one of growing. And so this year is a growing year for us. The symbol of the horse is one of power, and so we have the power to grow. Now, how do we wish to grow? Well, we wish to grow in a different way. We are in the midst of creating a new world based on what is closest to our hearts. Today, astrologically, the sun and the moon are in the sign of Aquarius. Aquarius really is the consciousness of the group and the common good, and so we are planting seeds for that. In today's new moon chart, there is a grand cardinal um, cro uh, excuse me, square. There's an opposition between um, Jupiter in Cancer and Pluto and um, Venus in um, Capricorn. That opposition is being, is being squared by Uranus and Aries. And so what does all that mean? Well, it means that we are aware of um, how our society has uh, been structured and how that either works or not, especially when it comes to us being who we are truly meant to be. And there lies the challenge and there lies the change. There is also a yod in today's new moon chart that actually includes the sun and the moon. The sun and the moon are making a sextile to Uranus. There was a sextile yesterday uh, to, of the sun to Uranus, and that sextile is about a reformation. We have an opportunity to reform the way that we create our future. Let's take that opportunity. The caveat is the um, point of the uh, yod where the finger of God points to, and it actually points to an asteroid, and asteroids are feminine. And the asteroid is actually to Pallas Athene in Virgo. Pallas Athene is about um, doing what we need to do to get the job done, but in a very um, um, proper, and there's a lot of, there's a sense of um, justice with Pallas Athene, she was the goddess of uh, strategy. And in Virgo, it's about healing. So how do we get to be who we are? How do we create this new society and take into consideration not just the healing of each other, but the healing of the planet? A lot to ponder on this new moon. Plant some good seeds and I'll see you tomorrow.